topic is governors. So what is a governor? A governor is a mechanical device which is installed into the engine to control the fuel supply as per the load. So now let us define it. A governor is a device which is used to maintain used to maintain the speed of an engine within the prescribed limits whenever there is change in load on the shaft so governor is a device which is used to maintain the speed of an engine within the prescribed limit whenever there is a change in load on the shaft so it clearly says that that when whenever there is a change in the load on the shaft the fuel supply must be prescribed and allowed so that there is a constant velocity of the engine so now there are basically two cases The first one is when the load on shaft increases. So in this condition that is there is a load on the shaft which is increased. So due to this increase in load there is a decrease in speed decrease in speed of engine so in order to maintain the constant speed there need to be supply of fuel to engine to maintain the constant speed this is done by a throttle throttle opening to supply fuel now the second condition is when the load on shaft decreases shaft decreases here increase in speed of engine and similarly supply of fuel to engine must be lowered must be lower and the throttle closing to supply fuel to the engine so these are the two condi various condition valves are operated through a suitable mechanism by a device known as governor so this throttle valves
are operated with a help of suitable mechanism known as governor so basically the governor is used in every engine to control the fuel supply to the engine as per the requirement when there is load condition and no load conditions the simplest diagram of the governor where these are the masses and it is the arm and these two are the stops this is the sleeve and it is the power from the engine and this is the bell crank lever and so the power from the engine is transmitted to the bevel gear which transmits the power to the governor so you can see this is the throttle wall throttle wall where the fuel comes in and goes out to the engine engine so when the there is a speed of rotation from the engine the bevel gear rotated and the rotation leads to the rotation of these masses and due to the rotation of these masses the centrifugal force is, is acting radially outward m r omega square radially outward it is acted radially outward so during the rotation motion this sleeve get shifted upward that is when the speed from the engine is very high this this sleeve gets shifted upward and due to this the black bell crank lever also get shifted upward which leads to the closing of the throttle that is at very high speed this throttle is closed down now when the speed from the engine is slow this sleeve will comes down and in turn the bell crank lever will also comes down leading to the more fuel supply at a time of more load because at high load the engine speed decreases and there is a more requirement of fuel to obtain that speed so that it thank you